suffering defeat after defeat. That man's body was reaching its limit, breaking down. But he couldn't die yet. The man had a job that must be done. To defeat his twin brother. Dante. from devil with the strength of the Yamato. And eventually, the man became a true devil. I've tried to hold together my crumbling flesh with what little demonic power I have left, but I'm approaching my limit. In separating and regaining my human soul, I've realized the gravity of the crime I've committed. I've realized how important everything was, everything I've thrown away in my pursuit of power. Is that why you went to find Dante? Yes, foolish. I thought that maybe he could change my... maybe fix. Maybe right my wrong. Tell me. Was this fool before you, right? I'm not your mommy, B. You're a big boy. And you need to see this through. Dante's war. That for Road Rash. What's up, everybody? Soul Zero here, back with another episode of Devil May Cry 5 Special Edition. We now have a new weapon, being the Calvi Cavalier. Cavalier. It's a demon bike. Um, let's see what I can. Uh... Alright, I don't gotta level up Ebony and Ivory anymore. Alright, nice. Okay. So... Yeah, uh, we got to see the birth of V and Urizen. I'm going to be right back because I got to look for the purple orb and the secret room in this mission. So I'll be right back and then we'll start it off. All right. I found it and I'm not too happy about it because uh, the secret mission kind of requires me to use enemy step, but... We'll, we'll figure it out when we're there. 
But let's go ahead and start this mission off, shall we? Unless you want to die. <laughs> Come on, show me what you got. Oh, damn. That was quick. Give me that. Motherfuckers. God damn it. God, Dante is so fun. Some blood, huh? Sorry, you wouldn't like mine. <sighs> we gotta go find uh, one of the Nidhog things. Yeah, we gotta find two actually. Huh? Fried blood in the gutter. Guess that explains how the pools down there get filled. Oh, there's one of them. A ran this is a random thought, but a tokusatsu Devil May Cry would go hard. I'm just saying. I know for damn sure I'd watch it. All right. I do know where the purple orb fragment is, too. So... <laughs> oh shit! You ain't scared, are you? 
Are you sucking blood? You are. Fuck. Get royal guarded, bitch! All right, buddy. Didn't do, didn't do too great, but it was, it was all right. Yeah, we're going to have to go through that. So, that's actually also going to be what fills up this blood fountain. If I follow these grooves... When in doubt, smack it. That's our family motto. Well, Dante is completely red now. He at least matches his jacket now, completely. And when he used to wear red pants. The one thing I will forever be disappointed about when it comes to this game, oh hey, it's right here, is uh, the lack of costumes for the characters. All we got is the recolor st uh, stuff, and that's kind of it. I mean, Virgil's is at least more of an actual costume than what Dante's is. If I remember, Dante's recolor outfit, attire, or whatever is supposed to resemble his, uh, DMC, like his reboot look, but even so, I would have loved to look like DMC 2 Dante in this game. You know, while being a really bad game, at least the way Dante looks in the game is really fucking cool. Broom. <laughs> Fucking awesome. Like you just had your ass handed to you. <laughs> oh my god, he wears goggles? I never noticed that. Oh wait, no. There was a reason why I went down there. <laughs> Outside of whooping their asses. Oh, that's right. That's where the other Nidhogg is. Okay, so we need to look for the other giant ass zit looking things. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> These motherfuckers are annoying. But they're not as bad as, uh... You know, the enemies in Devil May Cry 4. Moving? Damn it! Alright, I'm done trying to use the Royal Guard. <laughs> yeah, he, they're not too bad compared to, you know, those enemies in DMC4. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Oh, great. Crossroads. Decisions, decisions. Actually, have I ever died in Devil May Cry 4? Damn it. Did I, like, not die in Devil May Cry 4, but died in this game? No, that doesn't sound right. I'm pretty sure I died somewhere in DMC4, but I just don't remember right now. Oh, fuck. All right. All right, that didn't work. I can't fucking see! If anyone even saw me like do anything throughout that fucking fight, I at least look cool. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't look that cool. <laughs> Damn it. How am I gonna get to that? Oh. Nope, don't wanna be completely covered in blood again. The one next to that looks dry as fuck. I feel like you could fit through that. Don't want to keep Mr. Demon King waiting. Got to pick up the pace. All right. Uh, hold on. Yeah. 
I thought I wasn't gonna make it for a second. Hold on. Where is it? There it is. Thank you. There's the last one right there. Oh shit! God damn it! Yeah, stay in there for a little bit. <laughs> All right. Oh, wait. Come on, you can Wrong one. Over here. Come on, come at me, boy. No. Man. I'm bored. How do I I don't remember how to do it. There we go. Come on. Let's rock. Yes. Yeah. Had to make sure to uh, do his dance. Oh, hey, a gold orb. What's the point of taking this nidhog? It's been a while since I used my brain this much. I don't think there's really a point in doing it, but you know, I'll take it. Thank you. Okay, I thought I was gonna have to dash. Here you go. All right. Man, this brings me back. All right. 
Fuck. There we go. Stay in the air for more than 15 seconds. Can I do this? Let's go ahead and try. Nope. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Damn it! Okay, hold on. I can do it. I just need to... pull it off right. Damn it, why it wouldn't let me double jump? Or well, wouldn't let me do the other jump that I was trying to save. I can do this. Fuck, that counted too. I don't think I can even get up there. If I can, then it would make it a lot easier. Right there! Oh, okay, I... Fuck, dude. Oh my god, that motherfucker hit me. How about this? How well th will this do? Nope. Not good enough. I'll be right back. I'm gonna try to look at a at a guide real quick. All right. Yeah, let's go. Some of these are really stupid. There are some secret missions in this game that are really bad. There's one secret mission with V that we'll be getting to soon that just fucking sucks.
What could I get right now? Probably not much. Demonic power was activated in me once when Virgil lovingly jammed this through my chest. <laughs> I always wondered why did my father give me the rebellion? Okay, what are you muttering? <laughs> Over the years, I've been stabbed and jabbed by a number of things. But who would have ever guessed? <laughs> have you lost your mind? There's a demon to destroy! Kill yourself later! I'll help! If the Yamato can separate man from devil, then what about the rebellion? <laughs> Dante. Wait, is the boss fight right now? Oh shit!
this time and you still don't get it it is you who does not understand it has begun entirety. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. I still got some time. Uh, yeah. Like no one's worse for wear. <laughs> I'm just gonna double check. Hey, where did that garbage god go? What is Yuris in after? He's at the top of the Clyphod. It's the other way around, Dante. This is the lowest level of the Clyphod's upper echelon. Human blood is the source of demons' power. The fruit born through the Clyphod is even more dense than the blood that created it. Its power is unparalleled. Even the Almighty Mundus used it to become king of the underworld. Avid told me everything. Yeah, well, that's a lovely story and all, but as long as we know where to find him. Whoa, you are the infamous Dante. Um, <clears throat> I'm... Nicoletta G Goldstein. Sound familiar? <laughs> um, my grandmother is, is Nell Goldstein. The, the gunsmith that made all your fancy weapons that you've got strapped back there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there she is! <clears throat> mm, you don't much look like her. Yeah, I got my looks from my daddy. That's about all I got from him. But based on his research, I, I managed to cobble this. Um, it, it, consider it a gift in honor of us finally meeting. Um, meeting.
I'll take that. Dante. I'm gonna go too. Why don't you sit this one out? Oh, that you call me dead weight again? No thanks. I've got all the power I need. Right here. You don't understand. It's not what I mean. <laughs> Let him go, Dante. Time is a luxury that we can no longer afford. We must chase after him post haste. What? Does that mean you're going to? I have a duty to see this through. Well, that's all you had to say, Mr. Poetry. I'm gonna go my way, and you guys can go yours. Let's just say that's the best for the cause. We got the fucking hat. Okay. So, I want to do something a little interesting, kind of. Um, this mission, I think, is the only mission in the game where we have a choice of playing as one of the three characters. And I know uh, in a previous episode, I think, I had an... I had the choice to play as either Nero or V, and I did that. Um, but we don't have enough time in this episode and whatnot. So, uh, I wanted to have you guys pick what which character you want to watch me play as. So you can either, uh, right now, pick either V, Nero, or Dante, because I'm going to play as all three anyways. It's just saving you guys time for watching me play as all three of them within this one episode. So yeah. Um, pick who you want to watch me play as. And that'll be all for this episode. So please leave a like, comment, subscribe, share, and all the good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next episode of Devil May Cry 5 Special Edition.